Teacher Neth, and welcome back to Teacher Neth Explains channel. Starting this video lesson, we will talk about a big topic in math, which is statistics and probability. As an introduction, we will focus today on exploring random variables. A random variable is a variable whose possible values are determined by chance. A random variable is typically represented by an uppercase letter, usually X, while its corresponding lowercase letter X is used to represent one of its values. Let us take for example the following problem. A coin is tossed twice. Let the variable X represent the number of heads that results from this experiment. The table beside me shows that the values of the random variable x can be 0, 1, and 2. Moreover, there are two types of random variables. A random variable may be discrete or continuous. Discrete random variables can take a finite or countable number of distinct values, or values that are exact and are represented by non-negative whole numbers. For instance, number of trees on a farm, number of siblings, and number of students in a class. Continuous random variables can assume infinite number of values in an interval between two specific values. They can be represented not only by non-negative whole numbers, but also by fractions and decimals. They are often results of measurement. For instance, amount of cement used in building a house, weight or height of an individual, or amount of monthly electricity bill. Example 2. Classify each of the given data as discrete or continuous variable. First, distance covered in a travel. Is it discrete or continuous? Answer is, it is a continuous random variable. Next, volume of water in a container. Is it discrete or continuous? Answer is, volume is another continuous random variable. Next, votes in a poll. Answer is, since it corresponds to the number of persons and persons are represented by positive whole numbers, then this random variable is discrete. Next, slices of a pie. Discrete or continuous? Since number of slices can only be positive whole numbers regardless of the sizes of pieces, then this is a discrete random variable. Last, height of, skyscra of skyscrapers. Discrete or continuous? Answer is, since it is a measurement, then height is a continuous random variable. I hope you understand very well now the difference between a discrete and a continuous random variable. Until next time!